What's up everyone? Day 12. Day 12 of the six week challenge. My training has been freaking superb, if I say so myself. It's been great. You know what hasn't been great? My diet for the past two days. <laughs> it's been okay, but uh, I've had noodles for dinner for the past two days. Oh, freak, it was so good, man. Tell you what, Mega Ring noodles, the blue packet with peanut butter. Oh, man. Oh. Me and the missus had that last night, and I had it the night before as well. I was real carved up. Perhaps that was the reason why I done well in my run yesterday. I don't know. Regardless, back on track. <sighs> Look, that's my spirit bar, just in my hand. <sighs> it's push day today. More shoulder focus though. Planning to target the shoulders a bit more because I feel that big shoulders is the key to success you know every successful person that I've seen has reasonable sized shoulders so that must mean they must be lacking somewhere else but their shoulders are massive and they got success so that's what I want I don't know if you guys can tell but there's like no music at the gym right now a little bit awkward little, it, it, it's a little bit awkward <laughs> Felt good. Felt so good I might actually do one more. <laughs> but I won't. Okay. Lateral raises, but I've I've already done like a few sets on this, but I I, I really want to get big shoulders, so I'm I think time invested here is time well spent if I'm looking to have big shoulders. Do a little bit of tries and then I'll move on with my life and go into chest. Learn this one off TikTok. <laughs> Works well. I said I was gonna move it to chest, but I still wanna hurt my shoulders. Prioritize, you know? Prioritize my lacking points. Shoulder pump, baby. I'll tell you what, man. I'm feeling, I'm feeling the big stretch today, man. I'm feeling a massive stretch on my chest. Uh, so last one, and then I'll do a pick. I'll do one more, and we're done. This is like an old school machine, but it freaking works, man. <laughs> I feel a massive stretch on this. That's good. All right, last one. Last one, I'm out of here. Oh. <laughs> 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 
done. Now I'm done. All right, we got something different today. Got my protein shake like always. And I got four pieces of toast with avocado, um, salt and pepper, tomato, and a bit of sriracha. Let's have a taste, let's have a taste. But the secret to like avocado on toast is a crap load of salt and a crap load of pepper. <laughs> Setting her to go do the washing, you know? <laughs> Should we have a little bit of a gossip session? <laughs> so I've got a problem with these two people that I see most days. Now, it's their job to say hi. <laughs> That's literally your job, to welcome people into the establishment that I'm going to go in, which you work at. So I go in most mornings and I look over and they're just like this. There's two of them. And they're just down ignoring. Like, like on purpose as well, because the door is freaking loud and the door is right there. And it's your job to usually say, hi, hi, welcome. And they never do it. You know, they never do it. And the bad thing is, is that I feel like, like, you know, it's not that I feel, I definitely am. I am building this really bad picture on my mind about them, you know, and how useless they are. I just feel that sometimes we tend to paint bad pictures in our, in our minds about certain people, you know. Perhaps they've done something bad one time and then we continually think about it and then we continually build on it, all these possibilities and why they wronged us or why they done this to us. Maybe they pronounced my name wrong and I took it personally and there was a personal reason why they done that rather than just them just messing up there one time why don't I say hi hey Junior why don't you say hi why don't you be the first one to say hi for once eh hey yeah next time I go in I'm gonna say hi because and 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 I know they're going to ignore and pretend that they don't see me at first but I'm gonna force my high on them and say hello and they're gonna be like hey and after that i'm like cool move on you know i'm not entitled to anything we're not entitled to anything in this world even if people don't meet the requirements of what they're supposed to do is it really on you to try to demand it nah you know if everyone's human man if everyone's dealing with stuff we should learn to chill out move on there's <laughs> There's a lot worse that's happening in this life. 100%. There's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of bad things happening. And I'm just complaining about not getting the high. You know? Perspective. Small things, man. You know? Leave them small. You don't need to build up all these little hills into these massive mountains. Just leave them as they are. Just leave them in that. Move on. No point pondering about it and then building it up it's 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 unhealthy unlike this avocado toast with sriracha and tomato and a whole bunch of salt and pepper mm. anyway guys hold on let me have a couple bites as suspected this is 10 out of 10 anyway guys it's been great talking to you it's been great man tell you what it's been great uploading these and it's been great looking at the comments. Thank you guys for the comments, man. I try to reply to them. There's usually only like one or two, but I appreciate them, you know. Thank you so much. I'm going to finish this. You guys have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow.